Hello everyone, and welcome back to Pokemon Sword. Come on, Serene, can't just leave that Pokemon on its own. Slumbering Weld. Slumbering Wald? Slumbering Weald? I'm gonna go with Weald. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? The fog is really coming on thick now. If I don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Slumbering Weald. Oh! Fall grass. Oh my god, what the heck is that? Squovit? It's a freaking squirrel. I love it. Use tackle, okay. I don't know if I can do less damage with tackle. Oh wait, do I even have Pokeballs? I don't think I have Pokeballs yet, so I don't think I need to worry about trying to catch anything right now. I, I was thinking like, you know, gotta try to catch it, but yeah, I don't even think the game's given me any Pokeballs yet. Nope. No Pokeballs. Also, this this is amazing. Like, I love this like sneaking thing. This is the tall grass. That's cool. Doing all right there, Score Bunny. Let's be sure you're in tip-top shape. There. Now let's push on. Wow, I've had one battle hop. <laughs> like seriously. That I love that you like start sneaking when you walk through the tall grass. Like, unless you hold, like, the... Too nervous to eat berries. A nerve, okay. Like, unless you're holding, like, the full speed, you... Like, it doesn't slow you down, but you do that, like, sneak animation. And I kind of love that. I have the feeling that I'm going to be gushing a lot, and then I'm going to get a lot of comments being like, Oh my god, you're gushing so much at this game that's so bad. And I'm just like, I, I don't see it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, yeah, I've just started, so maybe that's part of it, but like, I don't see it. This just looks so good so far. Did you hear that? Is that a Pokemon crying out, you think? Are we going to see uh, the legendaries? Z what is it? Zamazenta and Zyan, I think. Effective. Neat. So they kept that in. So that's nice. I burned it. Nice. It's tail whip. Knock my defense down. Bah. Hate you. It is nice to see though that they kept the um, the the thing the thing in from Sun and Moon where you can see like whether a move is super effective or not after you fought the Pokemon once. <coughs> I always thought that was a handy f new feature. I mean, I get it, like, there's type advantages and stuff, and you can learn them. But I swear, sometimes there's, like, typings that I just completely forget. Come on, Serene, that Wooloo might be in real trouble. Oh, now you're not gonna heal my Pokemon? You heal my Pokemon to full after one battle where I've barely even been touched. But now you won't heal my Pokemon after like three battles. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I can't know why this place is off limits. Also, I wonder when I'll get to uh, like change my outfit and stuff. <coughs> She's very expressionate. Like she, the, the MC here has been very, um, expressionate so far. I love that. What in the? 
The Pokemon. Unknown appeared. Oh boy. Fighting the legendary already. Level unknown. Oh god. Nothing. Move has no effect. This Pokemon's gaze is fixed on you. What? The move had no effect on it. Tackle. Nothing. Move has no effect. It's an illusion. Serene, I can't see anything. You okay? Nothing again. Whoa! It's foggy! Can't see the friggin' tree in between the forest! Can't see anything! Ah! Oh! Up, Serene. Hello, Leon. What, well, Lee? How'd you manage to find your way here? Your pa your pants with directions. You always get lost. Pants with directions? What does that even mean? Oh, it's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you never showed. Of course, I came looking for the both of you. Hey, where's the Wulu? We're trying to rescue that Wulu. There it is. Meh. <laughs> Little chap's just fine. All of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here all the same. I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. At least that blue is alright, yeah, Serene? Thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked. At least it wasn't all for nothing. Touched by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed blood stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of presence. I mean, didn't even touch it. I mean, really. It seemed to pass right through it. Moose passed right through it. So, the fearsome Pokemon they say live in the slumbering wield. Are they actually illusions or something? It's strong enough, and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. But now, let's simply get out of this place. It'll be alright now that I'm here with you. Even if we did get near full from Lee, what an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go, she'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. What does that even mean? <laughs> oh my god. It's so, like, the, the lingo. I, I don't even know. Uh. <sighs> All right. Sorry, I was looking at something. Fuck. Oh, that must have been Score Bunny. Oh no, isn't Score Bunny just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. Glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. I mean, the score bunny will bow to the very end for you. So don't you go pushing the four deer too hard. Yeah, the fall was score bunny. And you, score bunny, look after my little Serene. Come home to rest anytime you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Aw, I love it. You're so adorable, Mom. Looks like your sweet score bunny might be running on empty. Let's have you rest up. I love that her name is Mum. <laughs> Like her name, literally her name is Mum in the uh, text box there. As long as you have Pokemon at your side and the energy to carry onward, you'll naturally find that you always have a smile on your face. I love her. Like, I seriously love her. 
I just met her, and I seriously already love her. Alright. I'm so used to, like, there being a run button, though, that it's so weird that I'm just, like, already running. Here we go. This is quite the big... This is quite the big step, you know? The first step toward becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Grookey a bit by having it battle against Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great... There. And the great red and white ball. Mark out... On front. I can read, really. It's a Pokemon Research Lab. Like, seriously, I can read. Well, found a potion. Neat. Also, wild Pokemon appearing in the, uh, the tall grass. I love that. Wild Rookity. All right. Yeah, I love that there's like overworld Pokemon. I thought I heard somebody say that that was only in the wild area, but I guess it's not. Unless this is the wild area? I'm very confused. Like, I thought the wild area was like a gigantic place. So... Like, I guess the, the overworld Pokemon are just everywhere? I mean, I like that. I really do like that the over, like the Pokemon are on the overworld. So I saw like an exclamation point down here somewhere. Oh, is it just because like I'm running through the tall grass? Okay. So it doesn't actually like mean that's like a Pokemon or anything. Woohoo! To paralyze heals. I think it just means like, oh hey, the Pokemon in the area are like in an Edisey or something. Oh, that's neat that it comes up with like a thing to tell you like what the item you just got is. There's Charizard. Charizard is too popular though. Let me just be honest. Uh, I, I, I like Charizard, but Charizard's too popular. Give me Squirtle. Not even Blastoise, just give me Squirtle. <laughs> I love his Charizard just walking into frame there. Well done, you reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. Did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless for directions. See how your world has already grown, all thanks to having Pokemon with you? I know I'm sure I know I'm sure glad I've got a Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now, in we go. I can read, honest. I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fast, fast, looks fascinating. Work. Oh my God! It's freaking Wormple. I think it's Wormple or Yamper. It's something like that. What is it today, Leon? Oh, hey, I know her. There's a lot of, um, not safe for work art of her out there. You can bring for another never before seen super strong Pokemon. Wish you'd stop with, those out with these outlandish requests. I think your name's Sophia or something. I'm glad to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. Oh, Sonia. Okay, I was completely off. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. <laughs> what kind of an introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you. It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. This is Serene. She's a new Pokemon trainer. Set her on the right path, would you? Oh my god, I have to get a Yamper. Yamper is so adorable. I want it. 
Ah, <sighs> what does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you've got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Oh uh, yeah, I do have a Rotom phone. <laughs> Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. So, are Rotoms just like really common or something? Like, I swear they were legendary Pokemon back in Sinnoh, but now they're like the Rotom decks and now they're Rotom phones and like everybody has a Rotom phone. Are, are Rotoms like just extremely common? That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry. So tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? You bet. Well said. In that case, I'll make it so that you can use the Pokedex on your Rotom phone. Yay, obtain the Pokedex. Okay. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my Gran. You let Gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down, al down along Route 2. Oh my god, and this just looks amazing. Like, everything about this game just looks amazing so far. Like, this could have been 2D textures, like all the books, but you can see that they're clearly 3D models. Like, oh my god, this just looks so good. Like, I don't know, so, uh, Maybe it comes in, maybe it's later in the game where things don't look good, but this looks so good so far. <laughs> it's just measuring something. The readings seem to be fluctuating. Whiteboard is positively covered with notes from top to bottom. It's all about Charizard, I see. Along with something else, but I don't know what. Like, I don't know what's on the left here. But that's definitely a Charizard. <laughs> They're studying Charizards. And there's stuff here all over, and like, I'm, th this looks like it's supposed to be a wall. But of course, you know, to like, not create like issues, it's see-through. So that way, like, you can come up here. Like, this is something that Mabinogi needs to do, where they just like, don't model these things. <laughs> like, seriously, I hate it when, they, when I'm like, up here kind of thing in Mabinogi, and it's just like, Oh, there's a wall blocking the camera. <laughs> Bobby, please. Uh, these plants take a great deal of care, but they all seem to be flourishing. Leon's a right amazing champion. I'm basically just an assistant. I'm not even Grand's official assistant either. I've just been calling myself one. Somehow, it makes me feel a little restless. Yay! Yep, yump. Yumper. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. There's lots of Pokemon lab, right? So that means you got a Pokedex, yeah? I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. Taint a potion. Not the po Pokeballs I expected it to be. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon's HP, their hit points, gets low. HP is like a Pokemon's stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power. It's a good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. I was hoping that would be Pokeballs. <laughs> I want to catch Pokemon already. If you ever get lost during your travels, don't forget your trusty town map. All around here is just quiet countryside, but wait until you see a big city. I'll take your breath away. Can I go in this house? Oh my god, I can. In a rather grand building beside us is the Pokemon Research Lab. If it's Professor Magnolia you're seeking, you'll find her at home, down the far end of Route 2. I see that the houses still don't have bedrooms. I just remembered what the sign here used to say. To the right is the Pokemon Lab, on the opposite side is the station. Welcome to the town of Wedgehurst. Our quiet borough is home to the esteemed Pokemon Research Lab. <laughs> Leon's just amazing. He's a superstar to everyone. I used to want to be a professional Pokemon trainer when I grow up. I can't talk, think about Pokemon day in and day out the way Leon does. This must be the train station. Welcome to the Pokemart. May I help you? Yes. 
Give me Pokeballs. Really? Still can't buy Pokeballs? I know, I probably have to get them in-game from somebody first. What would you see out the window of a train? It never stops changing. Isn't it lovely? Also, I love this, like... Um, the train has been delayed due to a rail car inspection. I love this, like, Pokemon script they've got going on all over the place. It's so cool. Like, normally all this stuff is, like, in English or whatever. But it's like, yeah, no, it's like... It, it's just cool. I love it. Char the Charizard pose. Just doing the pose along with Leon makes me feel like I've gotten stronger. I saw Leon at the station. He had such a one powerful presence. I recognized him before he even got close. Yeah, all the characters are, like, amazing looking. This is, like, the best looking Pokemon game yet. I freaking love it. That's your Pokedex from Sonya? It's time to meet lots of different Pokemon start building up a strong team. A battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way. Not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got Pokemon Centers. Lucky yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, train. Bet you've never been inside one. I do wonder when... Oh, hey, this Pokemon's in the uh, Pokemon Center as well, okay. I do wonder, though, when, like, um, customization becomes a thing. Probably later. Love with me, Serene. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? No, of course not. I don't think you need me to tell you what you already know. I really don't, thanks. If you kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Cheers, I'm all ready to go, though. Find to Route 2, Serene. Come find me, maybe, when you're done here. Also, I love joy -san from, like, like, I love her outfit in this game. Yay. She's so cute. Like, oh my god, everybody in this game is so freaking attractive. She's like, wrote them. Reading straighter. What can I help you with, Zert? Check boxes. Pokemon boxes! Don't need to really look at it because, yeah, it's just the same as ever. Neato. See you later. Some poke. You got some Pokemon questions? Feel free to ask away. Raid a nickname. Remember a move? Forget a move. Oh, wow. So, the, are the name raiders just like in the freaking Pokemarts? That's awesome. I'm sure, the wild Pokemon can be scary, but once they become your allies, there's nothing more reliable. I don't know that I need potions or anything. So thank you for Pokemon Centers. They kill your Pokemon as many times as you need, and for free. Because, like, I just looked at that. So, I guess I'll buy another five. Oh, wow, I can get revives this early in the game? I'll take, like, five of those just to have some. I don't know if I'll need them, but, yeah, the... the like, normally you can't get revives till later in the game. This month's birthday horoscope is spot on. Hmm? Do you want me to tell you your fortune too? Okay, in that case, can you tell me the month you were born? 08. August. Next, I need to know what day you were born. 21st. I got it. Birthday is 821. So, since you were born on 821, your fortune is... Let's see here. Hmm, what's this stain here? Oh, this must be from my snack. The page is smudged and I can't really read it. Ahem. Uh, people with your birthday are going to be super duper lucky. Might even run into a legendary Pokemon. Or maybe not. So anyway, see you later. Is that really what my fortune said? <laughs> if you're looking for the Pokemon Professor, you can usually find her at her lovely home by the lake, enjoying the slow life. In the morning, my Pokemon wakes me up, and in the evening, I put my Pokemon to bed. Can't imagine a life without Pokemon. Berries, I've got your fresh picked berries. What do you say? Interested in something? Ooh, berries. Neat. Paralysis, poison, and HP. Stop by, come again. I heard that Leon has a younger brother. 
But he's an amazing trainer, just like Leon. Oh, close the clothing store. Yes, absolutely. Did you know that each shop offers a different lineup of apparel brands? I think the brands they carry here might be a bit too young looking for me. And if you want to put on something you've bought, go ahead and, go ahead and use the fitting room. Yes, please. What can I get? Moose top. Um, nice. Uh, I need to... Yeah. Quit. I need to come in here and unequip the... Um, parka here. If I can. Uh, remove. There it is. There we go. Oh my god, I love this. I love that already. Loose top, striped top, striped top blue. Okay, and then the... Whoops. Oh, that must have been... Oh yeah, simple shirt dress. Okay. Skinny trousers, so that you can put on the shirts. Um, different socks. High socks. I guess I can't really see because of the, yeah, I couldn't really see because of the outfit I had. Um, oh, I can remove my hat. Nice. Um, glasses? Yes. I get glasses right away. I love this game already. Freaking, uh, would you like to go with this look? Yes. Go with this look for now. Yes. I love it already. <laughs> I like. I just love this outfit already. Um, although I do like these pink. Yes, please. Um, I'm just looking over what all they've got. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with that pink. Although the the black does look pretty nice. Um. Especially since I do have the darker skin tone, but I do like the pink. Put it on at once? Yes! Um, got some hoodies which are kind of cool. Like, usually I probably wouldn't go for those, but like these actually do look... Like, this looks really nice, the pink with the black hoodie. I might have to consider that. Um, what about pants? Do they have pink pants? They do. Neato. Although, I don't know, the all, the all pink doesn't quite look quite right. Um, black loafers. I kind of like the black loafers. Oh, but I like the white. Let's do the white and red. I'm going to use up all of my money on outfits this early in the game. <laughs> I'm going to have no money for, like, anything. <laughs> Ugh. Um, so do that white and red as well. And equip that. And I don't really need a hat. I prefer not having a hat, so. Like, I might pick up a hat eventually, but I like not having the hat at the moment. Ooh, but the black glasses, though, are way better. Oh my god. Never mind. I found pink glasses. I'm going for it. Um, you know what? Hang on. What if I do... What if I do the blue pants? And then the black hoodie. I like that outfit. Yes. I like it. We're going with this. Like, you know me, I'm usually one for going for like a... Uh, a semi-revealing outfit so I wouldn't normally pick a hoodie but like oh my god I freaking love this already can I like look at my oh mystery gift oh yes I can get the things I have so I have um the DLC so I have uh mystery gift stuff um so that's gonna be nice um, I guess I can't, like, look at myself like you normally can. Whoops. Wrong button. Hmm. Oh, well. Like, you, 
usually you have like a trainer card or something and you can like open that up and like look at your character more but I don't see that in here so that's all right it is what it is so there's no like zoom in or anything like that that I can see either so Oop. yeah I've hit all the buttons now that's all right I love this though like right off the bat yes I used up all of my money but right off the bat I have a look that I love like I really do this is super cute you know I might change the hair whenever that becomes available but honestly I'm okay with this look right now yeah Pookie doll I'm perfectly okay with this look. Having a meal with your Pokemon makes the food taste extra good. Now I just gotta figure out how to get a screenshot for the thumbnail. <laughs> Let's do some shopping in a boutique. Even just getting a new hat can change your whole look. Or removing my hat. Removing my hat does too. Listen, Strange, I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you just you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? Gym challenge? What's that? Gym challenge, mate. Annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to snuff. I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she could help. She got to, you've got to take part too. Proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger after all. Keeps you motivated, right? Professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams a chance to train up a bit along the way. Sure, but I'm not done exploring yet. <laughs> Sony and Leon used to have a healthy rivalry, but... But what? What happened? Leon loves, Leon loves Pokemon and loves Pokemon battles. I remember he would always go all out, even on practice matches. Well, as long as he's not... As long as nobody's Nuzlocke in here, I think we're all right. Basics for Pokemon trainers. Lesson 1. Pokemon at the top of your team will be the first one to enter battle. Basics for Pokemon trainers. Lesson 2. Don't forget to record your progress often. Basics for Pokemon trainers. Lesson 3. If Pokemon uses a move that matches its type, Pokemon's power increases. It's called same type attack bonus. Stab! Nope. Talk. D d this guy. Oh my god. Game. This guy. In order to bring out the full strength of their Pokemon, trainers must be knowledgeable. Wasn't even worth talking to him. <laughs> See that house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where the Pokemon Professor lives. Oh uh, yeah, I do see that. Oh my god, this looks so good from here. Like, the mountains and everything. I love the art style of this game. Like, uh, I just love everything so far. This is so good. Route 2, can you get Pokeballs, please hop? Over here, Serene. Please, I really want Pokemon. Alright, alright, Serene, it's time we filled out our teams a bit. Yeah, Pokeballs, let me here teach you how. <laughs> I just love Hop. I love Hop's reaction in the background. We need to catch Pokemon, I've got any hope of filling in that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? Every Pokemon has got a type or two, which can make it good against opponents, but poor against others. It's the reason you'll want to catch different Pokemon, to cover one, one another's weaknesses. Nah, I'll just catch Mewtwo, and then I won't have to worry about that. Now let's all have a champion time, as I show you how it's done. <coughs> but seriously though, back in Gen 1, once I caught Mewtwo, I used nothing else. <laughs> It was quite quite sad. Pokeball. Really? You're not even gonna weaken it before you catch it? Who are you? Go from the anime? <laughs> Just throwing Pokeballs, catching all the Pokemon. Meanwhile, freaking Satoshi is just like, hey! Again, you gotta weaken it first. Typical Lee. 
I'll give you some more Pokeballs. In return, I'll only ask that you ca catch plenty of Pokemon. Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. Almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? Wow, 20 Pokeballs. Alright. Pokemon on your team. Pokemon on your team will get experience when points when you catch Pokemon. Two. Of course, they get experience points from battle. Take on other trainers you meet along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. And even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? Alright, and when you catch loads of Pokemon, the Professor will be shocked when she sees. Can I catch a Yamper? I really want to catch a Yamper. We'll definitely catch a Rookity. I have seen that this thing evolves into something really cool. So. Also, if I just, like, linger on this screen, like, will it give me a good, like, shot? Mmm, probably not, because I've got the whole UI in the way here. Like, I want to get a screenshot. Like, of my character here, you know? For the thumbnail. <sighs> I don't know. You guys have already seen the thumbnail. I haven't decided on what the thumbnail is yet. So. But I will have by the time this goes up, so. Whoops. I did a little bit more damage to the Rookie D than I had really wanted to do. RIP. That was a level 5 Rookie D too. That would have been nice to get in my party right away. Rookie D's Unnerve. Oh, uh, the other, the other Rookie D didn't have Unnerve, I just realized. It would be nice if I could get like a good screenshot like what I had for Let's Go Eevee where it's like my trainer and the Eevee. It would be cool if I could get something like that with um... Oh, I can just hit X for the Pokeball. Neato. Oh, I've got 25 Pokeballs? But he only gave me 20! How do I have 25? I'm very confused. Got a rickety. Alright. Gain some experience. I love that you get experience now when you catch Pokemon. These data will be added to the Pokedex. Yay! It will bravely challenge any opponent no matter how powerful. This Pokemon benefits from every battle. Even a defeat increases its strength a bit. Neat. We're gonna name it... Sylvain. Just because Sylvain is my knight in Fire Emblem Three Houses. So we're gonna name him Sylvain. I know he becomes like a knight, so. Oh, trainer. Um, for that though, I do have some potions. Oh, wow. Sylvain's still got a burn. I don't have a thing for that, actually. Uh, well, crap. I didn't expect that it would still be burnt. Uh, quick, Pokemon Center. <laughs> oh, hi. What are you? Nick it. I love it. <laughs> Like, I already love it, and I've just seen it. It's female, too. Ooh. Ember? It's like a fox thing. I already love it. Hmm. Alright. Must have high special defense. That didn't do much. Quick attack! That did quite a bit more. Beat up! Ow! Critical hit! That wasn't... That bad. 
I don't know if it's gonna deal like a lot more damage like each time it uses it though. And it says that I was like hit one time by that. <coughs> well, well, go. I wonder if I can get that with like me throwing the Pokeball. Cause that was a good shot. I'll have to look and see what I can get out of the episodes. Like what look like good like shots. Nick it! Aided by the soft pads on its feet, it silently raids the food stores of other Pokemon. It survives off its ill-gotten gains. To give Nicket a nickname. Alright. Uh female Nicket. Um so it's like a fox type thing, right? Um We'll do Kira because Kira is my original character that has like, like the, so the Nicket is like a thief Pokemon kind of thing is what I'm getting from like the name and the fact it's a fox. And Kira's a thief. I mean, she's more a scion than she is a thief, but like her origins are, um, like being in the thief in like a thief guild and stuff like that so um but you know what i just noticed that we've been going now for about 40 minutes so i think we can go ahead and call this episode here i do hope you guys have enjoyed if you have feel free to subscribe check the video description down below for a link to the playlist that way you can get caught up on any episodes you might have missed and with that i'll see you guys next time See you later.